welcome to today's video if you're new here my name is monica welcome and for today's video as you guys can see i'm holding this huge pr box and this is the valentine's collection from kylie kylie cosmetics they came out with a super cute uh valentine's collection and in this video you're gonna watch me swatch the products you're gonna watch me create this cute little valentine's glam and uh, yeah i'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion on the products and the brands so if you want to see that make sure i keep watching how gorgeous is the packaging this year i love the heart it's really really pretty i love the red and pink the combination so whoa it's not me it's you so here's the packaging it's just so pretty i love the red this screams valentine's so these are two lip kits she has a lip gloss set eyeshadow palette this is a highlighter lashes and blushes so these are cream blushes i think or blush sticks she already has but i think like this is like uh improved formula which i'm really excited to try and i think that is a great thing that she did blushes for this collection because when i think about valentine's and i think that something that should have should be on a valentine's glam is blush i just i don't know i just like the red and pinks on a valentine's glam i think it become like it makes it look really pretty so i'm really excited about the blushes and the packaging is just like looks like candy it actually looks like candy it's so so pretty so i'm gonna start with my eyes and i did my brows first i'm gonna start with my eyes because if i start with my face and i'm going to play with glitter and reds i'm just gonna make like a mess i'm gonna mess up my my glam so i'm gonna start with my eyes first and then do the face so i'm gonna show you start to show you the palette this is the first thing that i'm gonna show you so this is the palette and i have some like little thing here where she says a bit more about the products and the prices so you have the eyeshadow here the eyeshadow palette and the price so this palette retails for 30 dollars it says like the benefits this is a limited edition 12 versatile shade it has three finishes uh, matte shimmer and metallic soft textures delivering highly pigmented color payoff so it does sound great let's open it up whoa that's so pretty it's so so pretty I love the color story. I love the red pinks. She doesn't have like a true true red like the top that I'm wearing. Cool thing is that you can with these shades do a kind of natural everyday kind of glam because she does have some like neutrals in here, but you also have some color and you can do a very beautiful rose gold kind of look with this palette and a more pinkish one and also you have these browns and these neutrals right here that are really pretty as well excuse my horrible tan i'm gonna just swatch some of the shades so you guys can see a bit so this is all for you and then i'm gonna swatch the little reddish shade this is by the fire which is a bit hard to swatch because it's a matte of course and then we're gonna swatch you up which is another shimmer and that was beautiful and then i'm gonna swatch his mine that's really pretty as well then i'm gonna swatch forever and ever really romantic names so these are a bit like you have to go over twice or three times and i'm gonna swatch cherries and cream and can't compete so they swatch okay, not the best palette to swatch ever, but they swatch okay, the shimmers really well, the mattes I had to go two or twice, uh, two or twice, two, two or three times over the shade, so it showed the, the color. Um, I got this from like, I think Shein or Amazon, like a pack of like 100 of them, and I use them when I want to have that sharp line and also to uh, yeah not get so much like color on my eyes and my under eyes so the first shade i'm gonna go into is be good to me which is this like neutral beige kind of shade like with a super fluffy brush i'm just like blending it all over my crease and like bring it super upwards now i'm gonna go with this shade right here adore you and just like place that on my crease and make it a little bit more pink now I'm gonna go with By the Fire, which is this vibrant reddish, pinkish coral kind of shade. I don't know exactly how to describe it, but I'm just gonna apply it on my other V uh, side of, like, on the other portion of my eye. I think now I'm gonna cut the crease. And I like to like smooth out the edges with my finger. 
before I go in with the eyeshadow. Then I'm gonna go with the same shade. This one is by the fire. And now I'm gonna apply the shimmers. I'm really excited for the shimmers. I think I'm gonna go with All For You on the middle and then like on the uh, inner corner there, I think I'm gonna go with this one right here, which looks like really pretty. Maybe I'm gonna even mix them a bit. So let's start with All For You, which is this shade right here. This is a really pretty shade. So that, and then I'm gonna go with Can't Compete on like the inner corner. Oh, this is so pretty. And I haven't wet the brushes. I'm just like, the brushes are dry and I'm just applying like the shade like that. It's like really pigmented, really amazing color payoff. I'm actually impressed. And then I'm gonna bring it to that pink shade, kind of like blend it too. And now I'm gonna remove this and see how the shape turned. Okay, that turned out great. And see how it helps with like not having so much like red fallout under my eye. That really did help a lot. And I'm pretty happy. It looks really nice. I think I'm just gonna blend a bit more of the red here so i have the hearts on this side and i think it come out really pretty so i'm gonna put them on the other eye as well and i think that when i'm done with the whole face i might put some hearts all over my face as well so both eyes have the hearts now and i'm really excited about how this look is starting to turn out and uh, these are the new lashes these are the false lashes by kylie jenner it doesn't say the name or anything to be honest with you these are not the type of lashes that i usually wear but i'm gonna give them a try uh, to see how they look on this look. I might like them, but yeah, I'm gonna have to trim them a bit and apply them It's kind of hard to do on camera. So I'm gonna just do that off camera and uh, See how I like them. Yeah. So the lashes are on and I'm actually Pretty impressed because I, I honestly no joke I honestly thought I would hate them because I'm I was not a fan of the lashes that Kylie previous had uh, previously had on her collection they were okay but like I'm very specific when it comes to lashes I have like my favorite styles from my favorite brands and those are the ones that I stick for I usually never try uh, lashes from other brands but these ones I love these ones I actually like I don't know it's just that it does something with my eye shape I have a really weird eye shape and my eyes are like these not like these so they fold downwards on like the edges here so it's really hard to find some lashes that like make my eyes look pretty and snatched so these kind of do that a bit and i really like the style like they are fluffy which i like they're not like very plastic like some lashes especially like lashes from brands like kylie and like other brands that don't do lashes when they come out with lashes they do very like cheap like kind of versions with like a plastic look but these are super fluffy and do not look like cheap at all they are 18 dollars this is like a reusable full strap lashes it's fluttery and it has a dull shape so now i'm gonna like do my base like foundation concealer etc etc and be right back to try the blushes and we have the highlighter and then finally the lip products so i'll be right back guys now it's finally time Time to try out the blushes i'm really excited about this because i love blush like blush is like a must-have on my uh, makeup routine and these look like candy don't they look amazing so i'm gonna open them up for you guys and test them out so she came out with three different blushes the packaging is very cute it looks just like candy here what's on the inside oh the packaging is so pretty they're so small on the internet they look really big they're pretty small oh this is so wow this is so cute okay so this is like the max so it's a bit like is not so much product so they are 17 dollars uh, it says that these features a light airy and cream to mac texture is smooth buildable and easy to blend uh, and it provides a flush of color with a velvety matte finish and to apply you just like lightly swipe on the cheeks and blend with your fingers sponge or brush okay so here are the shades we have a very pink one uh, a more like dark pink reddish kind of tone and then we have a very orange toned blush i personally like pinkish kind of tones i'm gonna like try to swatch them on my arm it's pigmented yeah this is more like a rose 
mauve kind of shade and this is in the shade making blush i like the shade so this is a way more pink kind of shade and this is cupid's crush so i'm a bit torn in between these two because i am not a fan of like orange uh, blushes i like uh, pink pink ones so i think i'm gonna apply this one so what i'm gonna do is like just what i always do is take a brush and then do this and apply direct into my cheeks oh that's so pretty and then on this side i'm just gonna try to apply directly yeah it works but i don't know i just feel like it goes way better if i do this So now it's time for highlighter and this is the highlighter that she came out with. I think this is a new formula. Let me check it out. Let me check the price and stuff. So yeah, this is like a limited edition Valentine's collection highlighter with a lightweight silky smooth formula that illuminates your complexion with a light big pink glow. It's available in the shade Dream About Me and it retails for $24. So $24 and yeah, this is cute. I really like the um the sheen and let's swatch it i'm just gonna like swatch it on my hand oh that's so pretty that's really really pretty oh my god that's so pretty This I like. This is like a big yay 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 for me. So next she came out with two lip kits. It's No One's Baby and About Last Night. Here they are. I love the packaging. Really, really, really pretty. Love her lips. And let's see the shades. So here they are. One is more like brownish nude and another one is a pinkish kind of shade. So I went to swatch them for you guys. So this one is No One's Baby and this one, it's the... Uh, let me see the name about last night so they are very similar in my opinion of course this one is a bit lighter and more brownish with a more brown undertone and this is way more pink but like put together they are pretty pretty similar so i think that she should have come with like a, a red or something they feel amazing on the skin their new formula since they like rebranded it's way better than the old formula way more comfortable way less drying Oh my god, these are a dream to apply. Like, so smooth. So lightweight, so comfortable. And then I'm gonna go into About Last Night, which is a lighter shade, and apply that on the middle, just to give a ombre look. Yeah, it doesn't make that... Yeah, it doesn't make much of a difference. Because the colors are really similar. This has the same price as it always had. Uh, $29 for the lipstick and the lip liner. This, I think it's a great deal. It's a great price. It's a liner and a lipstick. $29. That's great. This is like a highly pigmented, long-lasting, 8-hour wear formula. Super comfortable, true matte finish, and it doesn't feather on the lips. So, that's good stuff. That's stuff that we like. But, since she came out with the glosses, I have to uh, put a gloss on top. And the packaging is so cute. So these are the glosses. This one is like screaming my name. Oh, I love this pink. I think this is the one that I'm gonna go on top just to see how it looks with this lip underneath. So the darker one is in the clouds. The uh, super pink one is February Bay and the other one is Miss Jenner. So I'm gonna go with this one, so pretty. Let's see how this looks on top of what I have on. Okay, this shade is beautiful. I love the pink. I love the pink. I love the pink and red together. I mean, for Valentine's, it looks really nice. And her whole collection, like the pink and red, really inspired me to do pink and red together. And I'm leaving. I mean, there's a lot of red here. I don't think I'm gonna put like the hearts on the rest of my face. I think I'm gonna just leave it like this. So the gloss set with three glosses retails for 48 and is a new formula. Oh, it actually stays here that this is a non-sticky formula. I really like it. It feels amazing on the lips. It doesn't feel sticky at all. It feels really comfortable and it applied really well. It was so like it's just glided on. And yeah, so 48 for three. I don't think they're gonna like sell them separately, but I'm sure they're gonna come out with another like singles of these formula. I don't know. 
the same shades but i'm um, for sure they gonna come with more of these formulas i am feeling myself with this look honestly i feel like a cute little doll with these like different kind of lashes and the hearts and the pink i feel like a barbie a living barbie i am obsessed with the look i'm really happy with how it turned out i really enjoyed everything on this collection there are some things that i did like more than others there are some things that i thought were like basic and some things that i really really liked i love the new formula like on the gloss feels really amazing the new formula on the lipsticks are feels so good on the lips i am obsessed with the highlighter i think that's the thing this baby right here is the thing that i like the most uh just because how it looks on the skin it looks so wet like if you look straight at me you don't see it but when i turn in the light heats it's not like a straight line it actually melts into your skin and it's very wet that's exactly what i like in a highlighter this is giving me the um, uh fenty beauty uh, highlighter vibes it is like my top favorite because it melts into your skin it gives me that i am so obsessed with it so i really like that the blushes were really good as well it applied really well and the color is there i just wish they had more product in it i think it's too little and uh well more the lashes the lashes i'm actually impressed the eyeshadow palette was cute as well it's like a basic kylie kind of palette gives me a lot of like color pop vibes as the, the whole collection gives me a lot of like color pop vibes uh, but you can clearly see that kylie's products are a bit like more elevated i want to see from kylie more complexion products i want a foundation from her i want like i want her to elevate a bit but i am happy with everything that i tried today i am happy with how everything applied today and how things blended the blush is really beautiful highlight of my favorite let me know in the comments down below if you agree with me what you think about kylie and her brand do you have any of her products let me know in the comments down below and also if you want me to feel more reviews on any brand that you want just comment down below and i'm gonna do it if you are still here i goddamn love you thank you so much for watching me all this time thank you so much for the love if you like the video give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos and i am hoping and i'm gonna try to be consistent when it comes to posting and post a lot more so yeah i'm gonna see you soon hopefully see you on my next one bye bye